Hi class, I wanted to give you an art prompt idea to get you drawing and I'm going to be pulling some of these ideas from this book, 642 Things About Me, and um, you can just draw these on any piece of paper or even on a whiteboard, but it's I love the ideas that they have in this. So for this one you're going to draw your hair when it's messy and then draw your hair when it's neat. And so <laughs> I think for this one, I'm going to start off with the messy one because that's kind of fun. And I'm actually going to divide my page into two because I have two different major hairstyles <laughs> that I typically use. So I'm going to give myself a neck, maybe some shoulders, and I'm going to do that on both sides some shoulders and right now um, as you see pretty much every day in class I have really really short hair I cut it super short at the start of quarantine and if my hair is messy I like to call it rock star hair we were talking about um, <laughs> I should be part of Bon Jovi it just really does its own thing and even if I brush it it often will not listen to me um, and even when I try to squish it down with a with a headband it is just living its best life up there and the other way that my hair normally is if it's messy um, I used to have it really really long and I think for this one when it's messy um, when it's longer it really does just kinda stay it'll stay down that way and I don't usually have bangs so I'll just you know add my hair like this but even though it'll just kinda look big and normal I'm going to do a zoom in, and so I'm going to put a little arrow right here to the back, and then this doodle that I'm going to have is going to be as if we were really, really, really zooming in the back. And I don't know about you, but if, if you have long hair and you haven't bra brushed it in a while, or if you don't braid it when you go to sleep, it gets really knotted. And so I'm going to have my zoom in just be those horrible knots that I don't even know how they form. <laughs> But there's always like that one like really tough part on the inside. And that's my hair when it's messy. And so I think I'm going to keep that there. And then I'm going to draw my hair when it's neat. And so again, I'm going to divide it into two parts. I'm going to have my short hair part on the left and then my long hair part on the right. And with my hair, I know that my, um, my short hair it pretty much always looks wild, but when it's neat, it kind of does this really neat little swoopy thing, and it's a little bit more calm. So I'll just go ahead and add that calm there. And for my hair when it's neat, when it's long, I guess I, I could just do the same thing, but without all the little curly knots in there. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just make it so that it looks like I have braided my hair because my hair is really neat when I've braided it and I love braiding my hair because that means there are no knots in there because I had to carefully braid it to make sure there weren't knots all right so pretty simple but um first idea is to dry your hair when it's messy and dry your hair when it's neat and of course you can go back in and you can add you know if you want to add your eyebrows or an actual face in there you can or you can just kind of leave them like, you know, creepy no face people like like mine. <laughs> Here, I'll give myself a little smile. Because even when my hair is messy, I know I'm fabulous and so are you. Alright you guys, I'll see you later. Bye.